Hello again, YouTubers. This is your host, Black Samurai 7. I just want to make a video in response to this video that I saw on YouTube yesterday. And this is regarding a, an Uber driver from New York City. He was just working his job, minding his own business until he had until he picked up a customer to take the customer to wherever the customer had to go. And what did this customer do? She decided to act like a straight up wild hyena hood rat. The woman in this video was a straight up hood rat. She was acting like a hood rat. She freaking wanted to try to try to put some fake freaking charges on this man too. Another thing that pissed me off about this is that she want that she said the the go back to your country bullshit. I really am sick and tired of people saying that crap. Go back to your country. Who the hell are you to tell somebody to go back to your country? Do you not realize the United States of America, it's not yours? Do you not realize that this land was stolen by the from the Indians? Do you not understand that? You're going to fight over something that's not even yours. How nonsensical is that? Another thing, this, I can't believe it, yo. And like, and, I, I, and she kept bringing up her boyfriend, saying she's going to call her boyfriend, going to have her boyfriend be involved in this. I feel sorry for her boyfriend. I really, really do. I feel he, she's probably, he probably has to deal with this every day. Well, if you say that you love her and you lay, probably, probably laying down with this woman, probably, if you have probably got some kids with her already, or you're, trying to have some kids with her but i feel bad for you this is the woman you want to be with that's your business that's your decision but i think as i said before i've said this before in my videos if you have been watching my videos about wild hyena hood rats then you need to be careful on who you pick on who you pick to spend the rest of your life with because this is going to be on you too but i'm not putting the full blame on you but this is going to be on you um, on you if you decide to want to be with this woman. It's going to be on you, but the whole thing won't be on you. That's the thing. And I like what this man said at the end of this video. There's some straight up disgusting bitches out here, especially in the U.S. Like, and I hated the fact that when she said uh, where she was trying to say where she's from. I don't give a damn where that woman's from. I don't care. Like, I'm from urban Dorchester. I'm from the streets. So, but I don't give a damn where I'm from. Where I'm from should never matter when it comes to settling problems like this. Where you from doesn't matter. And I have to say, I give full props to this driver. He settled this whole thing 100% right. And I loved how he recorded this video by using, that, using his phone that he used for work. And that was great. Great job. So I give him a two thumbs up for that. He did a great job. To that driver... Give you 100%. I support you. And I hope that you continue doing a good job working for Uber. Like you said, you've been doing this job for over two years. And, excuse me, I wish you well. I wish you well. Continue working for Uber because I know some people that work for Uber too. And and um, I always pray that they'll be safe. They'll be working this job safely. And if they ever get some customers like that, you know what to do. Call the cops. May this video, may this video be, um, be a, not, I'm not saying it's a wake-up call, but I'm saying may this be a video, this video be as a warning, a warning and some, some advice on what to do if you're working for Uber, Lyft, or any of these other companies out there, where you got to use your own car, your own car to drive these disgusting people around. But it's a straight up truth. You don't know. You're never going to know. You're never going to know who the hell that person is that you allow to get in your car. You're never going to know. Unless if it's someone you know personally. But other than that. You're never going to know. And that's how it is. Unless you know. And again. I pray that you guys be safe. Be safe as you're out there. Driving on, driving in the streets of your, your neighborhoods. And your communities. And you. I understand you guys are make you. And I understand. Everybody needs a job. Everyone needs a job. To have the money to pay their bills. Feed their families. I get it. I'm an independent contractor, too. I work for Grubhub. So, yeah, I'm doing this to pay my bills, too. So we all need a job to pay our bills. And may we do just that. And for the woman in that video, woe to you. Woe to you. You shouldn't have said the crap that you said. And I hope that, you, that you'll that you learn your lesson and you will not act like that again. 
Now, that's all I got to say about this. Feel free to like, comment, and favorite my video. Or feel free to subscribe to my channel. See you guys later.